Hallelujah, it's done. I believe on this son. I am still. Historically, blacks were not free with any kind of communication from the government until June 19th. Juneteenth is the day in which enslaved individuals in Texas learned that they were free. Juneteenth is a day to pause and to reflect and to really assess where we are. When the announcement was made, the slaves began right away to celebrate and being thankful to God for being free. But there was a time when we were not free to do what we wanted to do, um, couldn't go and come, families were destroyed and broken up. I think there's a lot of confusion today amongst the younger generation about what Juneteenth is and who celebrates Juneteenth. Abraham Lincoln's Emancipation Proclamation, as important as it was then, and in some ways it's become even more important as a statement of the United States since that time, it, had a, it really was symbolic in many ways because when he issued it in January 1863, it did not go into effect. In other words, the South or the Confederates did not free their slaves at that time. So if the, if the owner wanted to keep his slaves, he kept them. And that's what they did in Texas. It was a uh, work from sun up to sundown, uh, no pay. Uh, food was what they could scrounge up, or they kept them happy, giving them uh, uh, chitlins, what we call chitlins, uh, uh, pig bellies, uh, the skin, which we made cracklings. Uh, they lived in slave quarters. Most of them had dirt floors. Gone and the friend from the cotton fields away. Gone from this world, the better world I know. I heard a gentle voice of calling. Juneteenth today is the same as it was 143 years ago. For Juneteenth is about freedom. It's about freedom to come, freedom to go, freedom to celebrate and freedom to not celebrate Juneteenth. And the freedom to forget, because in the beginning it was all so important for the freedmen to remember. It was like the Negro Passover. You had to remember what went on in the past. It was important uh, to that first generation of freedmen. Surely Jesus is able to carry me through. In some parts of the country, uh, they wanted to use the slaves to continue farming and ranching and doing work for them as long as they could. And they just uh, were blatant about saying, uh, we're not going to give this up. Oh my sister, oh my sister, if found beneath the my sister. According to what we know, when the announcement was made, the slaves uh, began right away to celebrate it and being thankful to God for being free.